So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to create a little bit of an endoskeleton for these objects. And I'm going to show you just some really quick ways to do that. Uh, I'm not going to go through the whole here so you can see this a little better. But you can see now, if you look down inside there, that there's a little bit of geometry going on. And what that does is it gives the, the wing a little bit more thickness, a little bit of a sense that it's actually been built this as fast as possible. So this, this is not exactly the, you know, the, uh, the most accurate um, piece, but it's to prove the concept. Now that I have this shaped, I'm going to go ahead and select the polygons and I'm going to bevel them. And I'm going to bevel them first with just an inset. In this case, I think about, let's go 0.25 and see how that looks. That's not bad. Damaged explosion objects. Okay, so we have a basic concept of how we're going to develop the skeleton. The next thing I want to do is I want to take those uh, damaged pieces and I want to make them a little more organic, a little, make the damage look a little more...